Yeah. So I um I was waiting to see if they waiting for this notice to come across the Qualcomm. It never did. And I'm seeing that the time is winding down. So I went over to uh to the DOT uh, clinic uh, to get a physical, and um uh, uh, they turned that new physical into DMV. It got certified out to 2023, August of 2023. So I'm like, I'm Gucci. You know what I'm saying? Jump back in my truck and I go back to work. Two weeks later, somebody's on my phone talking about, hey, did you go take that sleep study? I'm like, you guys never told me when to go or where to go. Or I'm like, I don't know the procedures for this stuff. Nobody talked to me about this stuff. All I know is that somebody said I needed to do it, but I don't know anything. I don't know the procedures. So, bro, I ended up having to pay $650 out of my pocket, man, to the American Sleep Study Medicine place to watch me sleep because they didn't set this mess up now they want to reimburse me for it because they said that they was supposed to pay for it but they got me sitting bro i'm sitting again i've been sitting for like almost two weeks waiting for these results to come back the results come back i bring them to the doctor they're like no you brought them to the wrong doctor you're supposed to bring them to the doctor in nashville but i'm like yo y'all never gave me any loads to go back to nashville to, to to see this lady or to do a sleep study there or anything. I've been over here. Wait. I'm like, yo, how is it? I'm like, how is it that y'all don't know what y'all company policy is? Wait, so they, so after you went and got another DOT physical and you, Mm -hmm. you, you, you got, you, you got your, you got your physical for four to two years. You still, you still, Okay, still gotta go take a, you still, yeah, still had to go, go you you still had to go and 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 do the do do the sleep study test even yes. though you got yes. your two year certificate yes yes even though the the other doctor did not detect no type of need to be doing a sleep apnea test or nothing like that gave me a clean bill of health these folks still gonna come after her and be like hey did you take that sleep study I was like, yo, this DOT doctor did not determine the same thing that the other doctor did. I don't understand what y'all are talking about. And then next thing I know, they shut me down, bro. It's been like I'm, I'm on my third week because I had to wait for these results to come back. So they got you on it a so like, they got you on a safety hold. Yeah, I'm on, I've been on a safety hold. Wow. So I got the results. And so now I take a physical, another physical in the morning with you. Bro, you gotta call, take, take you out. you gotta take another physical. Yeah, they they want me to take another physical with these results here, with these with these sleep study results. And I don't. And, but yo, check this out. This is what I don't understand. I called Georgia's uh, DMV to see if my CDL uh, had been rendered inactive because of this sleep study thing, and it's still active. It's it, my 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 CDL is active. My driver, my, my my driver's license is active. I have a, a medical card that doesn't expire until August of 2023, and he, the company is shutting me down because of this damn sleep study shit. Bro, you need to. You, you, I I know you say you don't want to. I, I know you say you don't want to bounce around or anything like that, but yeah, it it may be time for you to bounce, bro. I mean. From, hey, from, from, the, from the from 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 the point bouncing. from from the point that from from the point that they that they made with you on your you know on, on from from the recruiter all the way down to this sleep study bullshit man it's it's time to go bro yo but this is the thing lockout men I have been to bro I, if you I know. I dr- listen, listen, listen. I know. I know you've been to. I, listen, listen. I, I hear you. I know you've been to. Been through a lot. You know, you've been through a lot of companies, man. But you know, sitting on. You know, sitting number one, sitting on your ass and not making no money ain't ain't ain't, ain't working, my G. And you can and mm-hmm. you can and and listen, man. Listen, you listen. You ten years in the game. All right. I mean, you damn near twenty years in the game, bro. You, you know, you're not, you're not a, you, you're, you're not a new jack. So you're not, so you're not going to, you know, be suggested to. Okay, well, since you've been to this company, you've been to that company, you've been to this company, and all like that. That's that's not going to that's not going to affect you. You know what I'm saying? You've been 
you you been you got twenty years behind your back, man, and and this company right here is literally not doing not doing nothing for you. This company ain't doing nothing for you, bro. And you can explain that to the next company that you go to. You could explain the fact that, hey, you know, this company offered me this. They didn't they didn't live up to their, you know, they didn't live up to to what they were supposed to offer me. And then I got to go back and forth, back and forth with this. And then now this, you know, now they hold me hostage because of because of some sleep apnea that I really didn't need to take. I already got a clean bill of health from from DOT. My license is still valid. My certificate don't expire until two, 2023. This is 2021. Mm-hmm. Why? Why yep. am I? Why am I sitting? That's right, bro. We, I got you. Listen, listen, no listen, money. listen, listen. I listen. I got you. I I know. I know. I know a company. I listen. I I know a company that will be happy to get the to bring you in, man. I I know a company that'll be happy to bring you in. So I I got you. I I got you. If 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 that if that needs to if that needs be bruh, I got you. Because right now, land land air, it's not it's mm-hmm. it's not it, land air's not working, bro. I mean, I hate to say this, but hey, it's, hey, it's not on, working. Hey, hold on, hold on. Remember what I told you about the fleet manager? It's, it's not land air, bro. I think it's that fleet manager, man. That's who I think it is. Cause the dude that you was talking to. On your uh, on your podcast, the mm-hmm. dude that worked there, Lane there, he had nothing but good things to say about the company, bro. It's it, it's a me thing. For some reason, they just homing in on me. Maybe they don't like my dreadlock. Maybe they don't like that I wear black. Every day. I don't know. I listen, man. I listen. I got. I I I got a. I I got a guy. Uh, his name is uh, his name is Steve Green. He's out of uh he, the company is out of uh is out of Missouri, um is out of Missouri. I'll go ahead and uh as soon as we get done, I'll I'll test you his uh his phone number, or mm-hmm. or better yet, I'll I'll send I'll send I'll send the information over to him. Um, that's what I'll do. As soon as we get done, I'll go ahead and uh I'll go ahead and test uh your name and phone number over to him and um and have him to give you a call tomorrow and and uh and y'all and y'all could chop it up from there man let let that's, him know that's, let that's let him know your let, let him know your situation you know just just let him know your situation what's going on with you and and I'm 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 sure he'll be able to he'll be able to do something for you man because right now right now this is bullshit. This this is bullshit. They got they got they got you they got you sitting for damn near three weeks. Mm-hmm. They got you sitting for damn near three weeks on some bullshit, bro. So spending up the little money that they pay, spending up the little bit of money they don't pay me these past ninety days. Yeah, man. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, man. It's 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 time it's it's time to go, bro. It's it's. It's time to it, listen. Uh, it's, it's time to pack it up. <laughs> it's yeah, time. Least, it's time to pack it up and go, bro. Like this all in companies, man. I'm just like, yo, when is this mess gonna stop? Well, like I, 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 could, I could go to this other company that you recommended me to. How I know they're not gonna be playing games over there too? No, nah, trust me, man. They, they, trust me. The, the the guy that I the guy that I'm gonna hook you up with, he he he's not for the games, bro. All you gotta do is be honest with him. And he'll definitely be honest with you, man. So I'll I'll yeah. definitely I'll definitely get that uh soon like I said, as soon as uh we get finished talking, man, I'll test everything over to him tonight. And uh he'll he'll if if it's not him, he'll have one of his mm-hmm. people he'll have one of his peoples to reach out to you. All you gotta do is just let them know the situation, man, and I'm sure they'll they'll do something. They'll they'll be able to do something for you, man. 20, you know, damn near 20 years in the game, getting to run around like this, man. That's not cool. At every company that I go to, they're giving me runarounds. All my stuff is clean, bro. On record, man. My jack is clean. My clearinghouse is clean. My motor vehicle record is clean. My, my CSA scores are good. I'm like, I, don't under, I, I ain't had no accidents or incidents or 
bro, I'm, I'm almost Jesus in the damn trucking industry, bro. And I'm getting a run around at every trucking company that I go to. Well, like I said, man, I like I said, I I'll go ahead and uh I'll go ahead and uh send it send send it over to him and uh and uh let and let you guys uh let you guys chop it up and I'm 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 sure he'll be able to he'll be able to do something for you, man. So I'll I'll I got you on that. Um you you also mentioned something about uh was about Trans America. It, it, Trans America, you you mentioned something about you you mentioned something about uh you you what you did a I'm Facebook a live transport America. transport America transport America what what yeah. what ha what happened what happened to you over there, bro? That was a wrongful termination. All right, so in orientation, they are very very adamant about uh, making it clear to the driver. That they are, they have a no tolerance policy uh, for uh, uh, handheld phones mm -hmm. or, with, or, or or no touch phones. You know, like with the Bluetooth, they don't allow you to uh, be talking on a Bluetooth uh, while you're driving. If, if they determine that you are using a phone or talking on a Bluetooth while you're driving, they're gonna terminate. Right? Wow. But my thing, but that's but that, I don't talk when I'm driving. I I, I hardly ever even answer the phone, but what I do um, on my Facebook platform is I, I'll do, um, like, uh, safety videos while I'm driving, you know, mm -hmm. talking about, like, proper proper ways to merge, you know, mm -hmm. things to look out for when people are merging, you know, onto the highway. Do they have a yield sign at the end of the ramp? Do they not have a yield sign? You know, I'm, I'm like, doing, like, instructional videos, like, of driving videos. Right. And I'm not touching anything. And, and it's not even a two-way conversation. I'm just talking to the phone. And they terminated me over that. Because I, I I I could tell you, I I could tell you why on that one, man. A lot of a lot of companies, uh, <laughs> a lot of companies sees that as a as, as a distraction. Even if even if you do a a a one way conversation, you know, doing any type doing any type of live feed uh, while driving the truck, they think they, they, you know, not all companies because, like I said, I've seen. I, I've seen a lot of companies that, you know, that's that they don't care. You know what I'm saying? But majority of the companies like, you know, like, let's say, for example, you, you know, you, 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 you talking into the phone or you talking while you live and all like that. But then they could turn around and say, oh, OK, well, you you're you're acknowledging uh, whoever's conversating what you doing alive like a lot of people be like hey joe joe's in the building hey fred fred's in the building oh, no, gotta, i wasn't, gotta, I wasn't even doing that i wasn't even doing that I, I, you know the way my facebook is i you know my facebook to tell you the truth i'm one of those dudes that they got shadow banned because of the type of stuff that i be posting so people don't even be coming into my videos like that because when i go live they don't send out notifications so i wasn't even I'm not acknowledging anybody that's coming into the chat. Nobody came into the chat. It's just me talking about driving down the road. So I, I, it wasn't no two-way two conversations happening at all. But you do have drivers out there using them Bluetooth, and they having two-way conversations, and those are more distracting than a one-way conversation. Right, right. But, you know, so come, you know, you got to – this This is what you got to do. Um you know, and I tell everybody this now that that thick ass handbook, because a lot of companies is not going to tell they'll they'll tell you a little bit about their policies during orientation, but they ain't going to tell you everything about the policy. That handbook, mm -hmm. that 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 handbook that a lot of people neglect to freaking read. Yo, they ain't give us read, no handbook over here, bro. Read, read that, my bro. Land there gave us no hand, no land there handbook, bro. Uh, but they gave us was a, was a packet that shows us how to operate the call. Um, as far as like uh, land there company policies, no, they handed out no book. I, no, I'm, I I'm, I'm talking through. about I'm, I'm talking about I'm I'm talking about a uh, uh, trans what is it Transco America Tran Transport oh, America. Transport America. Did, yeah, Transport America. Now you say they now you say they they were strict about their no phone policy in in the in the uh. In the uh, 
in the orientation, though. They were very strict about uh, no use of Bluetooth in that orientation. Yes, sir, they were. But they didn't say anything about using a windshield mount because my, my phone is mounted on the windshield and it's in the, in the, in facing the highway. It, okay. it has the same view of the highway that I have. How? You know, and they say they, they didn't say anything about the. That's how? why I call it a wrongful termination. How, how, did they, how, how did they find out that that was you? How did, did somebody... Somebody had some. Somebody had your 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 Facebook account or something. You no 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 no. It wasn't nothing like that. I, I told them because I thought that I was doing something good, you know, by doing the instructional videos. But yeah. folks, you know, my, my, folks be my, hating, man. And they used Mo, it against me and they terminated Mo, me. Moses, here, here's a secret. <laughs> here's a secret, and the, this is the best. This is the best kept secret that a lawyer ever told me. Don't admit to nothing, bro. <laughs> don't don't, don't tell don't don't tell him don't tell him nothing. Don't admit to nothing. I didn't think, that I, was, I, didn't think I was breaking no policy, bro. I didn't think I was breaking no policy. I'm trying to tell you. I was like, yo, this is a windshield mount, and I'm not involved in any two way conversations. That's why I'm calling it a wrongful termination because I'm like, I didn't violate your policy. Y'all over here talking about. Bluetooth and two way conversations. I'm let, over here with a windshield mount and a one way conversation. Listen, let me let, let me let me tell you something, my J. Let me tell you something. Go back in my archives uh -huh. and 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 watch the video ambush. The video okay. amp the video ambush. That's when I that's when I got terminated from US Express. Mm -hmm. I got terminated for U.S. Express because of the same thing. I did not have I. I it was a one way conversation. I was making a video. the The GoPro was 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 strapped to my wrist. It wasn't in my hand. wasn't in my hand. wasn't in you know. It wasn't a phone or anything. But no, mm -hmm. they said that because it was a because it was a mobile device, and I even told them, I said this is a GoPro. I said, as a matter of fact, I got the camera right outside because the young lady told me I need to leave it, which I shouldn't have never did. I shouldn't have, you know. I'm I'm new to this shit. I'm I, you mm -hmm. know this is my rookie. This is my rookie time at US Express. I'm I'm brand new, fresh out the box, new to this shit. So when the chick told me, so yeah, bro, I, that's the same. I'm, that's the same thing that that that's the same thing that trans. What is it? Transport, Transport America yep. did to you. It's the same yeah. thing that U.S. Express did to me, man. You, you didn't feel some type of way. That you didn't feel like somebody was just fucking with you because they was hating on you. I, you know what? I, you know what? I, I've been, I, I've been feeling. I've been feeling fucked up like ever since I've been there. It's like every time I get a fucking load, they they don't send they don't they don't send me nowhere. I'm I'm supposed to be I'm supposed to be over the road, right? You know, like over the road, yeah. like you know, over the road. Tell me why the fuck I was up in the northeast like majority of the fucking time, bro. I mean, it's like I get a load, I I I get lucky, and I get a load that'll take me down to Laredo, Texas. All right, cool. Mm -hmm. That's some miles right there. That's about 15, 1,600 miles, straight shot, no problem. Get down mm -hmm. to Laredo, Texas, get another load that'll take me right back up in the fucking Northeast. And then when I get up there, it's always like, oh, well, we want you to run the TS loads. Um the TS is a uh, tractor supply over there off uh, mm -hmm. over there in uh, Maryland. I forgot. I, I forgot the city, but I, I cannot. Oh, fucking I, I, can't, I cannot I cannot fucking stand that place, man. That motherfucking pilot right right there on the fucking corner is like a motherfucking <laughs> is it's so damn small that you get you you you'll be fucking lucky to fucking find a parking spot there during the day because from the morning to fucking night that motherfucker is packed because of yep. because of motherfuckers waiting for motherfucking's loads over at the fucking t uh, tractor supply so yep, that's right 
I'm over here like, you know, I'm over here like, oh, okay, no, no problem. Yeah, you know, I, I could get you, I'll, I'll, I'll get you another load to, 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 to take you out. I, I, I promise, I promise. Nah, broken promises, all that shit. And every time I get a load, every time I get a load from Tractor Supply, it takes me further and further up north. Like, I, I, I get like motherfucking tractor supplies that's in the motherfucking cut bro like you get mm-hmm. off the highway and you still gotta drive through the fucking back roads for about two three fucking hours to get to this small mm-hmm. ass tractor supply that's in a motherfucking bum in a bum fucking city that don't even have a fucking dock right so yeah, I I felt you know like like you said I I felt I I felt some kind of way man because like I said it's it's like I I would get it's it's like I would get one good load that would take me out but then I get some bullshit load that will bring me back up and it's like it's it's like they can't never get me they they can't never get me nowhere they they can't get me over. They can't get me over in the west. They can't get me down south. They can't get me over in the uh in the uh northwest. Nowhere, man. And mm-hmm. I'm like, so let me the get this. You know, I was like, let me get this straight. I said, let me get this straight. Hold up. I said, do you do you want me to run the tractor supply? Because if that's the case, y'all need to pay me because I'm hearing people over here. That's running this little area getting paid way more than what I'm getting paid. And I'm like, well, if you want to do if you're gonna do that, then get then pay me. They they wouldn't they they well, wouldn't pay me or nothing like that. So Yeah, so you know now you know you're not the only person that's going through that. This this mess is happening out here, man. It seems like there's some kind of favoritism going on out here, bro. Uh, let me ask you this question, lockout. Mm-hmm. Um a driver with 17 years experience working at a company, how much you think that driver should be making each week bringing home? Oh, shit. Seven, 17 years. We, we talked, I, I talked about that some time ago, man. If, if, if you like, if you like 10, 15 going on down 20 years in the game, you should be at least, you should be at least a dollar or more, you know, that's, right. that's, like what, I, that's like what I, that's what I, that's what I think. But a lot of bring, companies. Bring home, how, much how much bringing home? How much a week though? How much a week? Oh, what at a yeah, at, a, do, at, at a dollar a mile? Shit, at least at least about at least about two uh about two 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 to two twenty five. That's what I'm saying. At that's least that's what I'm saying. And that's what that's and and, what that, and and you know and that's and and that's what's then that's for somebody that got you know you know, 17 years going on 20. And that's just my opinion. I got finished talking. I I got finished talking to uh, James, a 45 year driver. Mm -hmm. That's only make, that's only that, that, that was working for this, working for Smith. I believe it was Smith working for Smith. Mm -hmm. And he was, Mm -hmm. he was only at 50 cent a mile, bro. That's crazy. Yeah, because that—that's what I—I I was upset when I found out that Trucking Nails was getting fifty cents from Warner. I was way upset. I was like, "Yo, you really only have six months experience. They are—they paying you the same rate of uh, the same cents per mile that Covenant was paying me, hmm. and they was giving her more miles." That's why you got it. Like, that, that's why you got to like, do your. That's that's why you got to do your research, bro. You know that's that's why you got to do your research in the game, and that's well, why well, that's that's what I took. Because you know, I at Covenant, I had a trainer at Covenant, so mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying. That's, I, I didn't know any other companies to take her. You know that's that's you know that's what I'm saying. And some of these companies, like I said, you know, there's there's companies that you know, I, I don't know. I don't know. They, they you know, they, right now they they claim that they're in the driver shortage. They hurting for drivers and yada yada yada, and they you know changing their pay and all like that. Like I said, the guy who I'm going to hook you up with, you know, got uh, got pretty good pay and all like that. And you probably can you you could probably negotiate maybe a couple of cents more because of it because of your 17 year experience. So, but yeah, man, that's. Oh. 
that's crazy. <laughs> you know, crazy. Hey, you know, huh? Let me run this last thing by. Let me run this last thing by you too, though. And all of these years that I've been driving, I had never seen a check that was over a thousand dollars, bro. And I'm running off forty eight states. Now I'm over here at Land Air. I only run from Atlanta to Birmingham and back, and I'm bringing home a thousand dollars a week. Explain that. How is it I'm driving all forty eight states these seven? Uh, two thousand yes, these seventeen years, and I'm not seeing no thousand dollar paychecks, no checks over a thousand dollars. But I get over here to Land Air, you know, with my hazardous material endorsement. I'm just running from Atlanta to Birmingham and back, and I'm making a thousand dollars a week. And I'm not even working that long. I start at 7 o'clock in the morning, and I'll probably be done by 1 o'clock in the afternoon. Explain that. I make more money, and I work less. That's why I'm not so quick to leave. I feel like I, they know that I found the sweet spot. They just don't want me to have it. Mm. Well, like I said, just um, if, it's still, if it's still good, like I said, I'll, I'll still have him to – uh, reach out to you and, and and have and and have you guys to chop it up because you you probably might be able to bring home more and still work less because um because uh the company you know like I said they're based out of Missouri but they they do a lot you know they they focus on a lot of regional routes so mm-hmm. you know being that you in a you know being that you you in the southeast you know from Georgia you probably could get something that'll run from, you know, Missouri down to Florida and back up again and still, hey, you know, fam, and still be home on the weekend. Right. But fam, you think making that move right before winter into Missouri areas, you think that's really the right move to make right now, right before winter coming? I, like I said, right now, I'm in the Southeast. I mean, like I said, I mean, you, you, I mean, like I said, when you, when you, when you chop it up with them, you know, you can, you can set the area where you want to where where you, you want to run, you know, and, and oh, you know, see if it's feasible. Like I said, it's all about it's all about doing your research. I I can only open the door. You the one that has to walk into it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So yeah, man, I feel you. so as soon as I you know as soon as I give you know as soon as I give them that information and open that door from you, everything everything from everything from you walking into the door is all on you. So. You know, you, you let them know, you let them know, you know, how many years you drove, what you're looking for, how much money that you want to that you want to make or can't make and see if they can uh, see if they can, you know, accommodate that. You know what I'm saying? And, and Steve is a man of his word. I, I you know, Steve is, you know, out of, out of everybody I, I talk to, you know, with companies and all like that. Steve is a man of his word. If he says that you're going to do something or that he's going to do something for you, he's a man of his word that he's going to get it done. So, mm-hmm. so, you know, so like I said, I'll, I'll, I'll go ahead and pass that on to him tonight. Uh, and then hopefully he'll have somebody to reach out to you tomorrow and then y'all can go from there. And then it, it'll be up to you whether or not, you want to go, you know, the orientation to see what they got going, or you want to stay with land there and still try to give them a shot. Yeah. I appreciate the lookout, fam. I really do. No problem, man. That's what I'm here for. All right, man. Well, hey, great conversation, man. You are a citizen. So if whenever you want to come on and chop it up, man, we'll 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 get it in, bro. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, man. I appreciate you coming on, and uh, and uh, and you stay safe out there. And uh, you stay safe. I, hey, I'm I'm trying. <laughs> keep your chin up. Keep your spirits up. I will. I will. All right, bro. Great conversation, man. I appreciate you, and I'll holler at you in a bit. All right, brother. Peace. All right.